Hi, I'm Steve Williams, and this is Scooter in the Sticks. Friend and I had breakfast recently, and we were talking about what's involved in moving south to warmer weather. And one of the issues that came up was, what do you do about finding new friends in a new place? And I commented that, well, if you're a motorcycle or scooter rider, that common interest makes it a lot easier to meet new people. And with little effort, you can probably find new friends. And that uh, reminded me as I was riding over to the first moto hang of the season here, that's a gathering of scooter and motorcycle riders, how many friends I've made while riding. What about you? You made a lot of new friends riding? Let's go and have a look at the moto hang. So I'm on my way to the moto hang. It's a, an event where riders of different types and brands get together to tell lies and yak about motorcycles. And this first one of the season is at my friend Paul Ruby's house. So I'm heading over there now to uh, help him set up. He tells me I'm in charge of getting all the drinks together. It looks like you're all ready for your your event. You're expecting five, six people. I didn't say drama. There's no drama here. Go to Dave if you want to hear about drama. He's got the drama. No drama here. No motorcycle drama here. Don't ask Andy about the cost of Vespa repair. Yeah, do not, do ask, not me. ask him. Yes. So I'm tell me, familiar. are you happy we convinced you to keep your Vespa rather than buy a brand new one? Yes. Yes. Very happy. <laughs> now this yes. was the one you thought was ready for the scrap heap. Yeah. And okay. it's running like it's new. I mean, knock on wood. So it's amazing yeah. what the right repair will do. Yes. That's true. I was ready to throw in the towel. I thought maybe it's just is that too is old. Yeah. Yeah. There it is. Yeah, Steve had to like talk me off the ledge. And Paul. You take all the secondary ready. Well. So what time is it? It is 4:43. So people start arriving. This is my job. Get the beer ready. Got a couple more cases in the house. Then bring it all out. Soda pop, water. And Paul says that a quarter till will start building the fire. Getting ready for hamburgers. Yeah. I don't let it get too good. Yeah. <laughs> Was it an auction or just a yard sale? Yard it's still sale. the yard most sale. beautiful motorcycle yeah, here. <laughs> you know, yeah, well, yard sale. if you took those yellow uh, uh, covers $80. off, oh, just be some old <laughs> triumph. <laughs> I'm gonna say, some people hate those things. <laughs> nope, that's what makes. I hurt myself. Oh. I got a. I gotta be careful, but I didn't ride, it, it never got inspected, it never got registered in 2022. So since 21. Hey Chuck, not too bad. How are you? Good, somebody's talking about you the other day. John Eaton, you were making some prints for him? Oh yes, old yes. studio name. Hey Mike. Boy, that's a classic right there. <laughs> I left, so uh, you've emerged from your man cave to come down and join us here. One of the uh, many services of Paul Ruby is some old termite riddled pucks. We've had frost. Oh yeah, doesn't it? I uh. 
<laughs> Kawasaki Z900. <laughs> what do we got here? I thought that was stock cars. You added the other guy. He was a. He was a. This one. How's it going? I'm loading up my video camera. I take a picture of you doing videos. Okay. So how's it going? Oh, it's not too bad. How about with you? How's it, how's it going, Steve? Oh, let, me, let me see if I can uh, see me on the back. There you go. Yeah. Uh oh, something's on fire. Where's the flesh cooker? He's not paying attention. Holy moly. Those burgers look delicious. Now, Paul slaved over a hot stove for days to prepare all this food, you know. Oh. Hey there. How are you? Fine, thank you. Happy New Year. Happy New Year, yeah. Yeah. So you rode a Kawasaki over here? I did. You're being punished. No, I love that bike. <laughs> it's on my short list of bikes I'm going to keep. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, just park in here. Wow, Goldwing. Hey, John. Hey, how you doing? Good. You made it home safe? Yeah, I did. You know, I don't know where you get these old farts. They're, you're finding the photograph. But yeah. <laughs> I'm, I'm, it's not a big deal. How hey, you good. Are you filming? Yes, I am. Happy New Year. Decent. <laughs> you made it out here. Right? Happy, happy hang. <laughs> I should ask this mechanic here. You work on Royal Enfield Himalayans? Mm, never even rode one yet. Teenager. Yeah, no shit. It's crazy. What's this guy's name? Co-pilot. Co-pilot. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> gonna walk. Gonna walk. No, I brought I brought the car because I'm trying to give all that shit away. <laughs> you live that close to here? In Lamont, two miles. So, but um, these are these are bikes been in the garage. <laughs> They made an X, which is cross country, so you sit upright. That's what I was going to say. It's kind of neat. Park out in the street, too, you know. What do we got out here? Looks like we got some kind of Harley. Yep. Got a Harley, a Vespa, a Honda Nighthawk, a BMW R1200 RS. What is this? Suzuki GSX. Yeah, yeah. Like the last batch I made, and maybe yeah, they run the um, the yeah. But I'm you know, good now. Yeah, sounds good. Well, have a good one. They're pretty neat, huh? Yep. It's all over. Just the cleanup now. Stuff for the garbage.
see ya. So it was a successful moto hang, 41 or so motorcycles and riders, and uh, that kicks off the moto hang season. So I hope each of you have your own motorcycling group of friends or community that you can hang out with, but it's a lot of fun. But that wraps up this episode of Scooter and the Sticks. Until next time, be well and ride safe.